Dave. Come on, Dave. I honestly didn't know that David and Christian were going to give such great speeches. If I knew that, I would have gone before them. But um, I want to thank people as well. So uh, try to stay awake, guys. Um, first off, like one of the most underappreciated things, and like uh, that people that the people that don't get thanked that often is like our camera crew, Kathleen over here, Tux. Without you guys, we wouldn't have these memories, these like slideshows, these pictures. So thank you guys. Um, not only that, but. Jeff, Mr. ASA, and Christina Wynn, Mrs. ASA of this year. Thank you guys so much for coming out. Miss, <laughs> Miss, <laughs> Miss thank you for coming, guys. You guys did an awesome job. Thank you so much. Um, Janine, thank you for solo performing the Filipino National Anthem. Yay! I'm so proud of you. Janine is like a freshman this year, and she was willing to come up in front of all of you guys and sing the National Anthem. Like, that alone shows how much she cares about it. Dan Shoop for performing. Dan Shoop, you guys, our biggest show is this weekend, and they came out to perform for our gallery. Yep. Like, that means so much, guys. Thank you so much. Rubox, whenever we need a performer, like, we always can rely on you, Rubox. And, like, every single time we have you come up, you amaze us every single time, no matter what the case is. And just thank you for always being that member that always loves that and is always willing to perform for us. Oh, yeah. Daddy. This was briefly touched upon by David, but all of our present officers and our past officers, um, you guys don't know this, and you guys like might not even realize this, but without you guys, we wouldn't even be here. Yep. And at the end of the day, like the reason why you guys are here isn't because like FSA pays you or anything. It's because you guys love FSA, and that alone brings all of us together. So thank you so much, FSA officers. Um, Christian, Christian Ariola, like. How you're afraid to approach these guys, and that's how our generation is with you right now. I don't know if you know this, but you're basically like one of the legends of our generation. Hey! Let me go up to you. So many of our freshmen, and like even some of my class, they're afraid to go up to you, Christian, but not because you're a scary guy, but like they respect you that much. Um, <laughs> Your, your passion and drive for, like, not even just FSA, but every single thing you do, it just, like, serves as a reminder for each and every one of our members. Like, that's how each and every one of us should be for everything, not just FSA. And, like, for me personally, that's, like, a huge inspiration. So thank you so much. <laughs> David Galindo. I could, like, talk about you for, like, a whole hour. Um, <laughs> <laughs> like the whole, like, for, like, days. Um, you guys might not know this, but David's first officer position was Dan Shoup co-coordinator, and his next officer position was president. And um, it was the same thing for me, and, like, I've always looked up to David. Without David, honestly, we would probably have ten people in this room right now. Like, not gonna lie. David basically became the face of Gala, and he's not even president anymore. He advertised at every single meeting, every yep. single event. He was the guy that had no fear, no shame. He would always no plug Gala, no matter what. I see someone like talking about a basketball game, and David comments, Hey, are you going to Gala? Like, <laughs> and it's just awesome how much David loves FSA. And it continually inspires like our generation to make FSA great and to love FSA just close to as much as you have. So thank you so much, David. You, like, alone ignited the fire of this whole 20th anniversary thing. Um, without you, we wouldn't, me and David might not have even known that it was our 20th anniversary, to be honest. <laughs> not only that, but, like, you ignited FSA as a whole. Without you, like, we wouldn't even be here. FSA might not even exist. But this might be, like, an Asian Student Association gala instead of an FSA gala. You, like, you've ignited the fire in not only this anniversary, but in FSA as a whole. And 20 years from now, you still have the most love for FSA than, like, more love for FSA than anyone in the room. And with, like, because of that, I can't respect you anymore. So thank you so much, Tux. Thank you. And then finally, past presidents, um, you guys don't even know this, but you guys have such a huge influence on FSA. Each and every one of us here is here, not because of the food, not because of the performances, 
because each and every one of us love FSA. And if it wasn't for the foundation you guys set for us, we wouldn't be here. We wouldn't love FSA. And the bonds that we've created, the memories we all have, wouldn't have even existed if it wasn't for you guys. You guys like influence not only your generation, but even today you guys influence our generation. And that alone just shows how amazing you guys are and how amazing this organization is. So thank you so much guys for all the sacrifices you've made, for all the passion and all the inspiration you guys give us every single day. Thank you. And then finally, for everyone that's here today, like without you guys we wouldn't even have an FSA. You guys make FSA. As important as the presidents are, as important as the officers are, we do every single thing for FSA because of you guys. Because we want to give you guys the experience, the drive, the memories that FSA gave to us. And without you guys, like none of this could have been possible. FSA wouldn't even exist. And everything we do is for you guys. So thank you so much, guys, for just being here. With that being said, that concludes all my thank you guys. Um, Everything that we've all been waiting for, at least everything that I've been waiting for personally, is the dancing part of it. Yes. So, hey! So if you could uh, play September, that would be great. And everyone, everyone here knows September, or is going to learn right now. So you guys better all come up here and dance. Let's go, Matt. Matt first.